Oscar. What's up? Let me walk you down memory lane. Okay. Okay. All right. You're you're maybe six. I'm six. You're going to the movies where you were freaking quiet because you knew better. Yeah. Like everyone else should know better. Yeah, we talked about that. You you be quiet in theaters. Anyways, okay. you go to see this movie. You don't know if it's gonna be good. You're like it's probably gonna be good. You're watching Toy Story. Turns out to be pretty good. And then you watch Toy Story two, three, A Bug's Life. You got some Incredibles going on. This is this is Pixar heaven. I would name the rest, but there's just so many. And then you think nothing can get better than these. There's no way Pixar can do better than Toy Story I and Incredibles. That. I like Everyone that. thinks that. Mm -hmm. Well, you were fucking wrong. Oh shit. Everyone's wrong. Oh shit. Coco. Coco. Much better movie than any of those other Pixar pieces of shit. All right, they're yeah. not. They're not shit. But let me tell you what. Same. I've watched Pixar six times since it's come out, and I cried on every single one except the last one. Yeah. I shouldn't admit that. I mean, I will. nevertheless, even if Coco wasn't the best Pixar movie, like we're so very much stating right now, because it, it, is. it is the it, best Pixar the best movie one. out yet. Yeah. Fight us for it. Yeah. We don't care what you think. Toy Story nevertheless, was good, but even if that movie was a 70% mediocre, you would still cry that much. Yeah, probably. Probably. You got that. Let's be honest. It was a very sad Let's movie. Let's be honest. It is. It but is. it was a very good movie, too, And if too, you haven't people. seen it, good. we don't know what you're waiting for. And we just want you to sit here and really think about this, you know? Yeah. It's like, a lot of Pixar movies, they have really good meanings, you know? The, yeah, But, but Coco takes this to a cultural sense. Oh, man. It takes it to this, to this place to where we haven't been before. And it makes the dead become alive. Exactly. Which is something that sometimes we all need to think about sometimes, you know? Yeah. We sit here in in a valley of shadows, Steven, all and right. we never know when something's going to happen. But then you see Coco, oh. and everything's all right for a little bit. It's almost, like, it's almost like religion. I like you see that. Coco, and you're Pixar like, maybe it's not so religion. bad when I die. You Pixar know what I'm religion. saying? Like Pixar that. religion. We just like made that. something. We just I made do, something. I do live off those movies. Well, what's your favorite part of the movie? Ah, oh, man. I mean, if we're, if we're going to get the, the into music. it. The, the music. The music, hands fantastic. Down. I, yeah. I, I will I watch those movies, and now I'm just waiting for that song to yep. come up. And even if I'm not watching the movie, I have the soundtrack downloaded, and I'll just be like, hey, let me listen to Un Poco Loco real quick. Like, yeah, why not? exactly. I fucking love that song. Yeah, I, I so do love good. Un Poco Loco. I yeah. also like Hector. That's, Ooh, that's my yeah. favorite part of the movie, is yeah. Hector. He's a great character, down yeah. to earth, a lot of evolution mm -hmm. through the movie, you know? And and, and it fucking is just so good and meaningful and unravels a nice little twist and yeah. experience you didn't expect. A, a twist that completely got me. Like, yeah. And most I, of the people that I saw most people, like, yeah. whoa. Yeah, just like, just like that. when Zootopia got me with them blueberries, mm -hmm. completely got me. Yep. I did not expect that. Nope. I was like, this fox is going to eat nope. this little rabbit. No, another really not great movie, but not Pixar. Not Pixar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I wasn't yeah. trying to put I know, I get you. I get, yeah. But in case we have some people that aren't just uh, yeah, too they're educated like, they're on like, They're like, how can you say Coco? is better than Zootopia, which if it is, it is. But, but Zootopia, Zootopia is fantastic. Zootopia is very good. It, it, honestly, I would maybe have a, a closer of a battle between them if Zootopia was Pixar. I understand yeah. that, uh, that I would definitely put Coco it in the like top Disney three Pixar. if it was Pixar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, so yeah, yeah, yeah it is yeah. now that Disney owns Pixar, but still, like that's still the Pixar team that put yeah, yeah. their shit on if it. If there's a Pixar, Pixar label on it, it counts. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's what I'm going to say. Exactly. But, I like it. Boom. Wally. Wally, fantastic. A good movie. Yeah. Not as good as Coco. Uh, yeah, not as good as Zootopia. Yeah. But Incred it's good, so. Incredibles fantastic. And will Incredibles 2 beat Coco? Maybe. Who knows? Who Incredibles knows? is it probably goes for me Coco, Incredibles. And then Toy Story. Yeah. It's probably Probably goes about like that me, for me goes goes Coco, Toy Story. <sighs> Incredible. Fucking Toy Story 1. Yeah. <laughs> Toy Story 2 than Toy Story 1. Yeah. Sorry. I love Toy Story. Toy Story is fantastic. It's so good. Just not as good as it Coco. Could, it, it made my childhood be something completely different. That's mm -hmm. what Toy Story did. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? That's important. Yep. If without Toy Story, I would have never looked at my toys that the way that I did and played right. the way I did with them. Nice. It completely changed my childhood. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? But and see, Coco is good because it changed my adulthood. It changes Ooh. it changes what I look forward Ooh. to. The I respect of life. I feel like it, it's more it's more geared towards older audiences. It, like, it kind of is in a way. And, yeah. And it, it's it's geared towards that like that that like milestone in your life to where because yeah. everybody does eventually learn about death in yeah. one way or another, mm -hmm. and it's usually pretty important to you when you do mm -hmm. finally learn about it. And Coco really does it. It it makes that 
for it makes kids be able to realize that it it is a necessary part of life and that even though it's sad we could all accept it and celebrate it in one way or another you know what i mean yeah, actually nice. i couldn't i couldn't imagine watching it that age yeah huh. yeah yeah huh. very different movie when yeah. you were younger especially it especially makes me, yeah, yeah it makes me wonder if it's how around much maybe like it compared to like you know other other pixar movies yeah. if if you're yeah. that age like i don't know i don't yeah. know all I know is that this is, is a movie that's also making people want to play guitar and stuff, you know? People yeah. are buying the Coco guitars that's left good. and right now. That's awesome. And I'm going to tell you a fun fact right here. Yeah. This is going to be weird. Out of left oh. field, okay? All right. You know what, you know what Disney movie, movie made me want to play guitar? What? Which Freaky one? Friday. Oh, me okay. and my dad went to go see Freaky Friday in the theater, and I came out and I said, Dad, I want to play guitar. That's a good movie. Yeah. And then incidentally, Lindsay Lohan became a, a really drugged up bad person. And so did I. You know what I'm saying? GBW out.